Everybody knows that batteries have acids or alkalis in that are incredibly corrosive substances that cause burns. Um, when you actually swallow a button battery, in most instances it will pass through to the gut and completely not harm the child. But sometimes it can get stuck in the esophagus, which is the, the tube between your mouth and your stomach. And when a button battery will come into contact with the wall of the esophagus and generate an electrical charge, it will start to cause a burn. And you'll see in a little video clip um, a little button battery on a piece of ham and just quite the damage that it causes and how quick it happens. Um, so a button battery that gets stuck in a child's gullet will start to burn its way through that tissue. And that is a life-threatening emergency in itself. Um, it can be severely catastrophic if it comes into contact with a blood vessel or, or something. It, it can be life-threatening, really. Button batteries are obviously nice, shiny, attractive objects about the size of a sweet or a small coin. Um, children, as we do know, put things into their mouths, but I can tell you from experience they also like to put things into their noses and their ears, and that also would be very, very dangerous, and the, and the battery would need to be retrieved straight away by a medical professional. So if your child does unfortunately swallow a button battery, um, it is incredibly dangerous. It can be very, very harmful. So the immediate advice would be to get your child to hospital to an A&E straight away to be checked out. Um, if you don't have transport and can't get your child here quickly, don't be afraid to ring an ambulance. In the meantime, please don't give your child anything to eat or drink as we'd like them to have a nice empty tummy just in case emergency treatment is required.